The Nigerian ambassador to Benin Republic and a former chief of army staff, Lieutenant General Chukwu Burate, has called for caution on the use of divisive tactics capable of triggering disunity and avoidable hostility among political leaders in any part of the country. This is just as he urged leaders to de-escalate political tension among their followers in the interest of the country. TVC News correspondent Rafi Hamid reports. The unity of Nigeria has never been this threatened, especially since 1999, when the country returned to democracy. This is because of perceived injustice and poor governance, which has led to insecurity, secessionist agitations, bad economy, among others. At this event organized by the Nigerian Union of Journalists, Lieutenant General Tuku Buratai, who was represented by retired Brigadier General Sonny Usman, urged journalists to help in fostering unity in the country. In achieving this, he also calls on government to recognize the roles of traditional rulers. Journalists have played a very important role in the society. However, the current situation we found ourselves requires more responsibility and dedication and professionalism on the parts of journalists. Therefore, I would like to call on them to continue to have the unity, peace and security of this nation at heart in whatever they do, especially in their reportage of complex or crisis situations in this country. The Olu of Kuta, Obadekule Makama, noted that justice, equity and fairness must be upheld in the affairs of governance at all levels of government in the country to ensure meaningful and sustainable peace and unity. I urge the journalists to help us in propagating ideals. We have to have a common ideals in the nation. A common ideals, if we jointly agree that we want to remain one, under equity, fairness, let our youth be gainfully employed, let our youth be properly involved in nation building. So you could help us do that rather than bringing news that will divide us. The state governor, Buyiga Uyetola, represented by Commissioner for Information and Civic Orientation, Funke Gbemade, act on the need for peaceful coexistence among citizens. Those that we are stronger together as a nation. In Oshu, we are all one. The Igbos are allowed to perform. The Aousas are allowed to thrive. The Yorubas are accommodating. And that is why Oshu is safe. Because there is no discrimination. We are poor for everybody. Oba Dekulema Kam was decorated as a life patron of the Nigerian Union of Journalists for the State Broadcasting Service Chapel. Rafi Hamid, TVC News, Ushu